Good day everyone, I'm Dr. Ko Sishang from Respiratory Medicine Unit of Sarawak General Hospital, Malaysia. I would like to share with you an interesting case of malaidosis which we have encountered in our region. We have a 63 years old gentleman who presented with one month history of an insidious fever with chews and a non-productive cough associated with significant weight loss. He is a farmer from the central region of Sarawak, Malaysia. Physical examination and blood investigation were unremarkable. Planchers radiographs showed a left hinder mass. As patient's fever persisted despite a week of oral antibiotic, we carry out a CT thorax which show an enhancing mass at the outer pulmonary window abutting the left main bronchus and the descending thoracic aorta. A flexible bronchoscopy was scheduled in view of clinical suspicions of malignancy. Under white light bronchoscopy, the left main bronchus was grossly abnormal with a mucosal nodule. Narrow band imaging showed the overlying mucosa to be diffusely thickened, endobronchial biopsy and bronchial brushings were taken. Two weeks later, the patients attended our clinic for review. The endobronchial biopsy showed only inflamed granulation tissue and bronchial brushings were negative for bacterial, fungal, and mycobacterium. However, the patient was found to be the brow with unstable hemodynamic parameters. He developed septic shock requiring intensive care. Blood cultures subsequently grew Brucodaria pseudomalai confirmed by conventional biochemical testing and mass spectrometry. Patient gradually improved and was allowed home after a month of hospitalization. He completed six months of re-education therapy and a repeat CT scan showed resolution of the left hyaluronic mass. Malignosis is a common infectious disease in Southeast Asia, usually presenting as an acute febrile illness with pneumonia or chronic illness. It may present atypically as in our case, where we found only an isolated mediastinal mass representing a little trap for the unwary. Thank you for your attention.